I'm not drinking alcohol tonight, and I'll tell you why. Here's how you know you've had too much alcohol to drink. I got hammered last night. Okay, there's your first sign. I got hammered on a Wednesday night. Here's your second sign. First thing I do when I get real drunk, I take out my contact lenses, okay? Then I had a few more drinks. Then I tried to take out my contact lenses. You ever done that twice in a row? Oh my God, I am hammered. I'm gripping my eyeball, ripping right down my retina. Maybe I should dig a little deeper. Blood is pouring down my face, ruining my leather bathrobe. Sometimes I get so hammered I will pass out with the contacts still on my eyeballs, wake up the next morning, forget they're there, pop in two new fresh contacts over my contacts. I have 18 pairs of contacts in each one of my eyes right now. I can see your souls, Montreal. Played high school tennis, ladies. Think about that, huh? That's for you, ladies, high school tennis. Play collegiate tennis at the University of Illinois. Whoa, collegiate athlete up here, huh? Then I played professional tennis for four years. Whoa, pro athlete up here, huh? Whenever I tell people that, they always say the same thing. But Michael, we don't recognize you. We don't recognize you. Oh yeah, Canada, do you recognize me now? Do you recognize a champion? I live in Los Angeles, where I live now. Get a lot of parking tickets, yeah. Well, I used to. Not anymore, and you don't have to get parking tickets if you do what Costa did. I removed my windshield wipers. Where are you gonna put the ticket now, bitch? Where are you gonna put the ticket now, bitch? Advantage, no tickets. Disadvantage, rain. Should've thought about rain. All the money I saved on tickets now goes to collision repair. Do some dating in LA, that's right, went on a date recently, took my lady to a steakhouse, huh? What do you think about that? Steakhouse, huh? <laughs> Typical high maintenance Los Angeles date as I was valeting my Honda Civic. She says to me, but Michael, I'm a vegan. I'm a vegan, I didn't even know what that meant. I had to Wikipedia on my phone. Apparently being a vegan means you don't eat anything on a menu or at a grocery store that's convenient. <laughs> But I'm a gentleman, and I respect all ladies, and I respect all personal decisions. So I did what any nice gentleman would do. I drove to a very nice vegan restaurant, okay? Dropped her off and went back to the steakhouse. <laughs> I'm a meat eater. I ended up sleeping with that vegan lady. Huh? Huh? Just for fun, I used a lambskin condom. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I don't use condoms. Sometimes people think I'm gay. I get this sometimes, yeah, they do. Are you gay? People come up to me after the show, they always say the same thing. Michael, those are great jeans, right? Nice shirt, you have a good smile, soft eyes, nice skin tone. You seem like you get it. I bet you can speak different languages. I bet you're a good gardener, a good bowler. I bet you can change your own oil and refurbish furniture. I bet you make things out of hemp. <laughs> and then they say, are you gay? Michael, I'm not gay. Okay, I don't care if people are gay, no big deal. I don't think it makes me gay that if given the chance I would sleep with Justin Timberlake. I don't think it makes me gay that I would bang one of the greatest male musicians of our generation, okay? And Tom Brady. I don't think it makes me gay that I would sleep with Justin Timberlake, Tom Brady, George Clooney. I don't think it makes me gay that I may have made a list of men I wanna have sex with. David Beckham, Joe Biden, uh, the sham wow guy. I would bang that sham wow guy hard. <laughs> Cleanup's easy. Think about that. <laughs> Sidney Crosby, but he has to wear his gold medal. Um, <laughs> the Spanish soccer team. <laughs> Anyone from Toronto, but they have to wear a bag over their head. <laughs> I figured you'd like that one. <laughs> Ugly asses. Uh, Lloyd Robertson, that's his retirement gift. <laughs> Nicholas Sarkozy, uh, Roger Federer, and lastly, comedian Michael Costa. You should have sex with him. Thanks so much. Good night, you guys. Bye.